Welcome, Jeff Coughlin, Scale Modelling Now. I wanted to show you this new title from Osprey Publishing. It's Cold War Fleet by Clive and Sue Taylor. And what um, an extraordinary volume this is. Uh, hardback, it's got over 300 pages in it and it is just full of high quality images of <coughs> Royal Naval vessels, a 66 to 91. Uh, it's um, uh, build as a photograph album and that's exactly what you've got. You've got everything from the carriers through to all the other kind of vessels from frigates to cruisers to heavens knows what. And I think what I particularly like about this title is its scope. It just seems to cover just about every ship and vessel that um, the Royal Navy have uh, operated during that uh, time. And to that end uh, itself is, is uh, a huge bonus. I think additionally, um, from a modeling perspective now, this is tremendous because you've got high quality imagery, it's all black and white. I don't think it loses anything for that given that most um, Royal Naval vessels are, are gray anyway. Um, I think you get better definition with a lot of the photography with black and white. So in fact, I think that's actually a strength this time round, as opposed to perhaps different titles where colour would be a huge advantage. Of course, you've got submarines as well and all the different categories and classes of those, right the way through to patrol uh, vessels um, and the like. So this is huge in terms of its scope. I, I think it's going to be really popular. Uh, even landing craft are, are included, as you can see here. But um, I think just so many little things... Um, that come come to me. I think one is. I mean, let's just take. Here we are. We've opened this, uh, this book. It was on page two hundred and ten. We're looking at minor landing craft. So what does this tell us? Well, just look at this from a modelling perspective. If I just bring you in, you can see. Just look at the fine details here that are fabulous in terms of um, a steer when you're building models. Not only not only have you got these massive aerial arrays here of the the tanks that are on board this landing ship. You've got all the scuffing, you've got the paint chipping, you've got the corrosion, you've got chains hanging down here, you've got exhaust standing around the back end here. I mean, it kind of goes on. So really good uh, motivational stuff, it seems to me. And if you want a challenge, well, how about this vessel over here, this landing craft? Well, just check out the almost um, checkerboard um, paneling uh, and rippling that you get in the um, side of the hull here. So that kind of thing would be a tremendous uh, challenge to try and reproduce accurately in model form. Doable, um, so why not? So yeah, I, I, all I've got is huge praise for this. The quality is exceptional. It is a, a fabulous title. And if you are remotely interested in Royal, the Royal Navy, uh, naval vessels, the Cold War, this has just got a huge amount to, to offer and is highly recommended. So that's Cold War Fleet by Clive and Sue Taylor, Ships of the Royal Navy 66 to 91, a photographic album. Highly recommended.